Hello everyone. Today I will be going to teach you about the concept of tree topology, how to make in Cisco Packet Tracer. So basically, what is a tree topology? So tree topology is a connection of starburst topology. It is a special type of structure where many connected elements are arranged like the branches of a tree to the central node. So this is how we make tree topology in Cisco Packet Tracer. For that, you need uh, around uh, six pieces. Because in tree topology there is one backbone and that backbone the leaves are acting as the nodes. So I am going to take here six pieces. I have took here six pieces and now a networking device that you need to select here is switch. You can press control and select switch so that it automatically comes now. After doing this much, now you have to connect two pieces with one switch. Look, there are three switches, so there are six pieces. And you have to connect two pieces with one switch. Now, a point to be noted is that you need to connect the networking device with this copper crossover wire. This point is important that whenever you connect a networking device to a networking device you connect with a copper crossover wire and when you connect the uh, node a computer with a networking device you use copper straight through wire you can press control and then select copper straight through so it automatically comes you can select any ethernet port of switch doesn't matter after doing this much now you have to assign IP addresses to the PCs you can assign any IP address to the PCs it can be class A, B, C I'm going to provide a class A address which is 1.1.1.1 cop control all control C so that only we need to do the change at the last bit which is our host bit do the similar step to all the PCs Note that uh, a tree topology is a connection of uh, a star and a bus topology where this trunk switch is acting as a node or a backbone of this tree topology. And in my upcoming videos, I'm going to show you how to make mesh and hybrid topology. And please like, share, and subscribe to my video. Now after assigning uh, IP addresses to all the PCs, now we have to do the P uh, sending message from one IP address to another IP address. So for that, first of all click on the simulation. There, there are all edit filters, you have to show all none. And you have to select the filter called ICMP which means Internet Control Message Protocol which is used to transfer the message PD from one PC to another PC. Close this. Now you need to transfer the message suppose I want to send the message from this PC 0 to PC 5 look the status is in progress now so run you will see the message is being transferred now it will return back to the same PC from where it has come So this is how we make tree topology in Cisco Packet Tracer. I will write here. This is tree topology. And 
now i'm going to tell you about what are the advantages and disadvantages of having a tree topology so first is it is highly scalable improved performance reduced network traffic flexibility and redundancy segmentation and isolation these are five are the advantages of tree topology now if there are advantages there will be disadvantages of having a tree topology as well dependency on the root node if this central node this switch node this trunk of a tree gets fail the whole network will shut down uh, there is a limited scalability in certain cases cost implementation is there means high cost is there complex network design and maintenance so this is a complex structure as you can see so this is how we make tree topology in this packet tracer and i have told you about the advantage and disadvantage and definition as well so i hope you like my video if you like it then please share and subscribe as well